What is a control arm? Welcome to Mercy J Auto Care, where compassion and craftsmanship come together. I'm Rick Smith, Master Certified Technician. Now you gotta realize, when we're driving down the road, our wheels need to be able to go up and down, our front wheels need to turn, and so all this movement needs to take place. So imagine my two arms are a control arm, and this right here would connect, in this case, say the bottom of the wheel. We could have one at the bottom and one at the top. But if I fly like a chicken wing, that means the wheels can go up and down, right? So, here's a control arm. On the, on the body side, not the road side, but the body side, we have bushings. These bushings can get torn or wear. When they do that, we might get a clunk when we're braking or accelerating. Or we could be wearing tires because the alignment will be out. Out here we have a ball joint, and that joint is what allows things to move around, turn, go up and down, twist. And uh, when these wear, sometimes we can get basically a wobble after we go over bumps or something like that. Like I said, depends on the suspension design. Some we might just have a lower control arm, some we might have a lower and an upper. Some cars are even more complex than that, and they have multi-link suspensions. But I hope that this helps you understand what a control arm is. And until next time, safe travels and blessings to you.